Another day of drilling. Hey guys, another episode, season two. Looking here at our storage, at our trade port, and we are about to get rolling here. Sent over some more money from Burton Basin, so we are not going to be wasting our time with funding this operation. We are already there. So, let's go ahead. One thing to note, um, we'll maybe hop over there in a minute here. The Petroleum HQ actually went ahead and put it in the same thing in Burton Basin. I kind of want that to be the headquarters for all of our HQs or whatnot. So, I moved that over there. So, we technically don't really need this anymore. Um, we'll leave it there for now, but we kind of can get rid of it. So, as you can see, my oil refinery is now opened up. I upgraded the, the HQ in the other city so we don't really need it now i did receive a couple comments regarding the amount of pump stations i have and i do have i can dad i could definitely add another one here somewhere and i think i can add a couple more here and can i add any more here yeah i can add a couple more here I mean, whatever. I mean, it might not be the most, but it's something. Oh, I can't add one here. Huh. Come on. Let's go, team. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, there we go. Alright, so we're maxed out there. And we gotta do a couple delivery trucks, or at least one more. That'll be fine. And we're all we're full storage on everything. Oh, we're maxed out there. And I think can we do another one here? We are at nine of ten here. That's not really worth it. Nope. This is kind of tough. You know, you forget how helpful the road grids are or whatever. That would be cool if they had them here for the for the oil. That'll work for now. And how many trucks? I got a couple trucks there. Okay. So, oil refinery. We were gonna, I was going to put it back in here. It's a nice little spot for it. We don't really need too much road attention to it because it's only going to be for our delivery trucks. We can... Let's see. Create a little bend over here. This little, this little scenic road around the bend here. And this will be a home to our refineries. Let's see if we can get at least one here. Maybe that wasn't the best idea. Let's straighten this out. Because we want to maximize our area over here. Another comment I received too is, you know, why am I putting all my residential right at the opening of the of the map? Hey, and you know what, you're right. But at the same time, I'm not too focused on residents here. I mean, as long as we have enough residents to employ our pumping stations, I this is not going to be that type of town where, you know, we're focused so much on placement and parks and stuff like that this is this is strictly for that's fine we'll we can always move this here this is more of a town just for our resources you know so but appreciate everyone's feedback it i i look at every well i want to say every comment but mostly every comment i receive through my email so i, I do take a look at pretty much everything now, this is we are going to use oil to make our fuel now. What do we need to... We have a plastic polymizer. We need this. In fact, for right now, let's just get rid of that. Because we're going to try to get this fuel done as quickly as possible. So we can put a fuel center there and a fuel center there. And as soon as this guy gets up and running here, 
they're going to turn the crude oil we have into fuel and then I'm going to ship the fuel over to the great work site and we are strapped for people let's add some workers because before you know it this gets I don't want to put the people there I mean should we go up the hill guys I think we should go up the hill How the heck that's gonna work? Let's see how this is gonna. Um, I think this thing is so, so steep. I don't know. If... Uh oh, what was that? Yeah, this is this is ridiculously steep. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, but, wow! What did it do? To, it ruined the road. No, I gotta keep that. I can't stand looking at that. Let's all have to come around the bend here. We'll have more workers. And you can see we're losing money, but it's. And we have no power either. That could be an issue. Let me pause this for a second before we have a real disaster. I could I didn't know that was a solar plant I put there. I don't want to use our oil. Let's use our coal. Because I know there's coal up here. Hold on a second. Let's just put the coal plant down for now. I know there's coal on this map. Coal, 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 where you at? There it is, okay. So, that's why all of our city services are freaking going nuts, because they don't have any power. All right, so let that open up. And let's continue with our little, our beautiful scenic, Scenic roads, people. Scenic roads, it's all about. You know, the roads in this game, I mean, I, I just don't get it. Like, you know, the gr the grids, I'm, I'm a big fan of the grids. But other times, I mean, the roads just get so, like, skewed out. It's kind of, kind of annoying to keep up with, but... Alright, let's add a few people over here. We don't want to... Okay, we got more oil over here, so we don't want to mess with that. We can add some residents on this side out here. And we should get some... Right? Where are we at, oil? Okay, beautiful. What is this? Upgraded. Don't really need the city hall here, but... We backed up. Now this guy's got a real, real problem. Buildings need the water. sure do need water this is probably gonna warrant an actual water plant because all these industrial buildings are they're they're drawing so much water out of the ground so let's put what can we put this guy at oh man maybe we are like on the verge of collapse in the city, guys. I've I'm beside myself. Let's see. Let's make. Okay. And then let's do it right. Let's get our water down because not sewage, but water. 
and we will let that get up and running. Let's play it again. And the city needs power. Why are we still in the negative with that? Is it really not give that much power? Currently generating 75 milliwatts. Man, these things soak up electricity. Oh my goodness. That's crazy to me. Are we making fuel yet? Oh, they got no they got no water or no workers. I I would think that's a problem. Nobody to work there and you got no water. Maybe that's not maybe that's why nobody works there. You can't even wash your hands. Alright, let's put some more peeps up here. Is that medium density? Alright, cool. And medium density. Man, I tell you, you know, I <laughs> been messing around with SimCity 2000. I know I asked you guys in the previous episode if that's something you guys would want to see. Maybe like a short little, <laughs> maybe like an hour long episode. I don't know how anyone used to play that game. I mean, there's so many like, bugs and oh my goodness. I, I It's fun though. I mean, I, I did get a couple cities built up today. It's, if you guys want to see that, let me know. I can put together a couple small episodes and can reminisce about the old times. But yeah, definitely let me know in the comments if you'd like to see that. Also, I've got SimCity 3000, 2000. I've got... There's a couple of them. I was looking on the webpage. These games that came out, like SimCity Societies. I personally never played them. Let me know if you guys have played any of these, if any of them are, are pretty decent. I, I've definitely played SimCity 2000, SimCity 3000. And... Was there even a 4,000? I don't even remember. But I have played some of those. And they are pretty fun. But like I said, SimCity 2000's got so many bugs in it, it's just... It drives me nuts. But... Let's see, where are we at on grids? Where are we at on grids, people? Where'd my grids go? Alright, we're moving along. Just need some workers, that's all we're doing here. Nothing nothing crazy. Just, just trying to get some workers to move into town. We don't really have... Do we have a police station? I don't even know. We got a fire station. I'm thinking some of these amenities might be keeping people away, but... Do we do trash service? We got trash. So we're good on that. What else? Just the bare essentials. Back the pipes again. Let's put one of these out here, too. And then we can get rid of these poop factories. And we'll clean up that guy's backyard because, man, he has been... He has been smelling it lately. Excellence. Let's check out what's going on. What is this? Do we have a sign of this? General powered electric. They're soaking up power. Abandoned buildings over. Kabam. All right. So we got fuel, guys. We've got fuel. Are we up and running over here yet? They're producing plastic. I guess we'll leave one of the plastics. Because we are going to need plastic eventually. Um, it doesn't hurt to start saving up now. Let's build another trade depot just for plastic. And 
and we're going to just use it locally. We're just going to save up here. The plastic is going to be used for the processor assembly. Where are we at? Oh, here we go. Some more homes in here. I'm just trying to squeeze these guys in anywhere I can. And I guess, I suppose, let's just put a little park or something small for these. Wow, look how bad the land value is. Oh my goodness. It's atrocious. I don't know. Something for you punks. Losing a lot of money here. It's going to start coming around, though. And at any time, I, you know, we can start forcing out or start selling some of this stuff. This we can probably shut down. That's 450 an hour we can save. We are well on our way to... Do we have any trucks going over here yet? No, you could see one here, though. At first, or that initial... Delivery at the great work usually takes a minute and then once you get that first one you start rolling and it's it's Smooth sailing from there on out um, What was I gonna do? Yeah, let's raise the taxes a little bit. I, I just want to balance out this budget just a tad We've got zero commercial in this town, which might be a problem as you can see more people are leaving the town than coming in so Um doesn't hurt to add a couple stores, you know, just there is some sort of demand for it. Same thing up here next to these guys. There is a little bit of demand, so you don't want you don't want them to be too mad, you know. Um and, and like I said, this is strictly for worker purposes. This is not anything too extravagant or this is a this is a project here. Got one truck. Got another truck, maybe. I'm not gonna sign here. Man, these plants are pretty serious. Everything's pretty serious in this game. We've got quite the supply here. So the oil, we're pumping the oil. Oil's coming here. Then we're sending the oil from here over here. And it's making fuel. And then the fuel is going to the Great Works site. And then any additional fuel, we got some some spots here for it. And moving around all that, we've got plastic that is going to stick here for now. So, looking pretty good. You can kind of see Burton Basin in the distance out there. I'm not sure why you don't... Oh, there it is. I was going to say, I'm not sure why you don't see the space station yet, but it's it's a work in progress. It is a work in progress. And... Still haven't gotten that first delivery yet, but it's coming. I promise you, it's coming. Let's go to Cheetah Speed for now. A little bit of a traffic jam up here. much fuel we produce and not as much as I thought. I'm almost want to put another one of these. You know? Can we do another one? Should we do how much do these cost? 600 an hour is not the worst. I'm in progress, not interested. Backed up pipes, that I am interested in. These industry and these factories, they really pack on that sewage. You'll notice that too. I don't have freight producers. So what, that's industry, right? I think it is. I don't want that too close to our water supply, though. So, 
something there. And we're off. This is what we've been waiting for. We're at the point now where we are producing the fuel. The other thing that we should probably be concerned about is alloy and trying to scout out where we're going to do with that. Because the alloy, what do you need? Ore and coal to make alloy or something like that, I think. There's no ore up here. Coal there is. About putting that coal plant over here for the for the power plant. Let's see. There it is. It'll be mad. Don't be mad. And they're closed again. See, we're having a worker problem, guys. We're having a worker problem. Let's add some more. I mean, we've got 8,500 people. You'd think there'd be enough people here. Well, you would think, but... Give me my grades. I wonder if we might need some sort of medium wealth. Like a little I know we have a little bit of medium wealth over here. I don't want to go too strong with it. Let's see, we we'll got nobody unemployed. It's the majority, nothing really high wealth that we need. Though it wouldn't hurt to have like a little quadrant over here or somewhere with some high wealth. Let's see. All right, so we'll make that medium. This will be low and then let's make a little small section out here. Just some sort of high high wealth, efficient living. And they'll ba basically be the people that bitch about everything. That's what we'll have over here. And we can add a plaza or something. What can we do? Okay, that's one. There. I'll give us some sort of high wealth people. Alright, now move on in. And this is just to basically deliver to our, our power plant. We're not really going to go too crazy with that yet. But the fuel is here. The fuel is why we're doing this, guys. The amount of oil that's under here is more than enough. We've even got a plot over here and over here that we can take with and which I'm thinking right now, we could probably go on one more. Let's see. Crude oil. See, we're not we're not shipping it out quick enough. Is what we got going on here now. We're drilling for it. We're getting it out of the ground, but we're not moving it enough. We're gonna take that one out for right now. Budget problems. Watch out. Watch out for that budget. Mayor, quit spending all that money. in this game they warn you about the budget some of the past games they don't really say much and before you know it you are you are in the dumps man in the dumps have we sent over something yet all right we are on the board 3,000 we got more trucks coming that is what i wanted to see this episode 
All right, and we got another truck coming here. So we are moving, 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 moving. We're gonna hit that 170,000 pretty quick. I am confident of that. Um, okay. Let's see. I know, I know. I got my eyes on it. Any plastic here? No, we'll leave that leaves locally. Stick it just to get us out of the. Get us out of the dumps, man. Get us out of the dumps. But yeah, you know, money goes quick, but it, it, funding the great works, um, it's it's a process and it does cost you, but ultimately it, it's it's what you pretty much play for, unless at least that's what I think. You try to get try to get everything over there, you try to basically field your region with the great works choice that you pick. For example, my last season I used it for you know, the airport was more of a tourist type destination and it helped you out a lot. And then you got the, you know, the solar farm if you're trying to build like a more of a green type region. And then of course, now we've got this here, the space station, which I believe is the more difficult of the three. If I had to choose when I've done all of them to get up and running, and this is more of the kind of the tourist type, you know, education area. And that's what we're gonna focus on on this one. I wish, though, you would be able to link more than one great works to this particular region. This region, I think, is seven cities, I want to say. How many cities? Seven? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, seven cities and one great works. So, I mean, we've got, we've got some, we've got some work to do here. I'm really happy that we were able to get on the board, though, regarding the shipment. Now we're at 8,000. This is going to go pretty quick. And let's see. I just want to confirm and I want to show you guys what, where we're headed. So in order to produce alloy. Yeah. Smelt raw ore into metal. Or add coal into the mix to smelt alloy. Sell metal or alloy. Okay, so we need this. That's going to be for the alloy aspect of it. So we might have to see where we're going to go with that. I'm not sure because we don't have any ore here. We can maybe ship it over from, from you know where, from Burt Basin. So that's maybe we can gift it over here. Um, let's see if we can get that started. All right. As far as oil, we have, let's see, where can we put this? We're going to do one of these, and we're going to, we're going to see how that works out, because we've got plenty of ore over there, and this we need raw ore, right? Oh, here we go, raw ore. Get out of here. We'll just leave that for now, and then when I'm, I'm gonna when I hang up here, I'm gonna go ahead over to Burton Basin and send us 80 tons of raw ore, and get that filled up, and we'll keep that. And then we have our coal plant, so we might have to. We're already at full storage, but we might have to use that in conjunction with the ore that we send over to produce some of the alloy. 1,400 isn't the most amount. It's really not. It's it's definitely feasible, and as you can see, we're already at 11,000. So. You know, we're close to 10% there already. Here, we got another truck heading in. And, you know, you guys get the idea. So we'll go and wrap this one up. I appreciate everyone tuning in, leaving your messages. Be sure to drop a like for more SimCity. Helps grow the channel, helps grow the followers that you guys have, and adds more to the conversation. So until next time, we'll see.